I require a man of God. I require the morning text. I require flowers. I require date nights. I require time. I require respect. I remember when I first got on this app and I said, we as women should not be engaging in these meaningless hookups with men who do not value us. And I was basically for the longest of time calling out liberal feminists for pushing this sexual liberation, quotation marks, movement and masking it with empowerment to these young girls. And I remember when I first came out with that, you know, people told me, they said, you're part of purity culture. People called me misogynistic. People said, oh, you're against women. You're just judgmental of women. And how funny it is that, uh, that these same women who once promoted this lifestyle of sexual liberation are now rebranding into modesty. How funny it is that these women are realizing that that lifestyle that they once promoted was not getting them anywhere. So now they want to rebrand as modesty. And we have long shamed modesty, but maturity comes when we realize modesty is not a bad thing. After these women like Brittany Renner and Alexis Sky has led on an entire generation of women into this thinking that sexual liberation is okay and it's your body, do what you want with it, right? It is so funny that these women are now turning around and trying to change the beat of their drums because they're realizing the dangers of this lifestyle. And it's been women like me and some other women on this app who have been trying to long telling women that this lifestyle promiscuity and sexual liberation is dangerous. But we get called purity culture for it. We get called misogynistic. We get accused of being a part of hyper conservative conservativeness. All because we were trying to warn y'all that this lifestyle is not okay. And the girls that, that were hypersexual and who did promote this lifestyle, they always come at the end. Notice how it's a pattern. They always, at the end, they always come back with a sob story or with a story that I changed y'all. Because they realize that, that lifestyle don't get them nowhere. And I have made an Instagram story both criticizing Brittany Renner and Alexis Sky for long promoting this lifestyle. You have built platform off this lifestyle. You have built wealth off of this lifestyle. And so to now turn around and rebrand after you have led an entire generation of women and now you're posting how you want man God when you have promoted everything otherwise, I've been telling y'all all along.